Tonight in Fox Community, Thanksgiving dinner will look different for families across the country. Changes are also expected at several local shelters serving up hot meals to those in need. We feel like we need to bring back some sense of normalcy, some sense of community, some sense of love in our community. The Salvation Army is trying to bring some normalcy on Thanksgiving Day. They're continuing their tradition of serving hot meals, but with precautions due to COVID-19. This year to-go meals will be offered and there will be limited tables outside and all will be socially distanced. Like I said, the need is great this year. Uh, there are a lot of people that um, will be coming to pick up meals to take home. No volunteers will be allowed inside the Shreveport Bossier Rescue Mission because of social distancing guidelines, but they're in need of volunteers to deliver meals on Thanksgiving Day. We're asking everybody to remain in their cars, to wear masks, and to practice good social distancing whenever they deliver those meals. Meals. The goal is to serve a thousand meals in the community and two to three hundred on site at the rescue mission. I think in 2020, uh, people are feeling isolated, they're feeling lonely, and to have a Thanksgiving meal uh, provided to them by a stranger just would mean the world and would give this, them uplift and hope that they de so desperately need. With the pandemic, Christian Service has been dishing out more meals than usual, and Al Moore expects that to be the case on Thanksgiving. Clients must wear a mask and on that that day, they'll only be serving to go meals. The numbers are up. We're expecting a big crowd to come in on uh, Thanksgiving Day because of the pandemic. A lot of people are not working. They don't have a resource to have any meals. And many of these organizations are accepting donations. To learn more about how you can give, visit our website. Oklahoma Governor Kevin Stitt is imposing new restrictions on bars and restaurants. He's also requiring masks in state buildings to help control the surging number of coronavirus infections. Today he announced his plan saying tables and all restaurants and bars will be